Hey guys, my name is Theo Chito Nguan, and today I'm going to show you how to make a simple 3D text uh, to use as a background or wallpaper or whatever you want with Cinema 4D. Okay, the first thing we have to do is insert our basic our basic text. Sorry. Now, go over here and select text. Insert whatever you want, and choose the font you like the most. I like um, Birth of a Hero. Okay, so we have our text, but if you press animate, nothing happens. But go over here, select extrude nerves, and drag the text softly under them. Okay, now we got a simple 3D text, but we can always make it better. And that can be achieved by many ways. Uh, so go to extrude nerves, object, movement should be like 60. Yeah, perfect. And caps, make the start of it full of cap. Perfect, perfect. Now close this and have it selected. Press Ctrl C, Ctrl V. And we have a second text, which should be um, go to object, make this one. 20 and nothing happens but don't worry go over here and drag it into the middle okay awesome now there's still not any difference but if you go to caps and make the start of it fillet cap you can make it you still have a best the best uh, free text we can get and this is your animate it looks like that. Okay, now let's add some color. Go over here, double click, and um, select the color you want. I want to be red, this one. Let's add the spatula, tick on reflection, make this one fresno, and make it red too. Okay, tinker with it. Okay, that's how I like it. And now drag it on the back, on the second layer. Oh, okay, here it is. Now double click again, and add a second one. This one should be blue. I like blue. Okay, nice. Go to color, and select blue too. Reflection, textures to be Fresno, and again, tinker with it. That's how I like it. Okay, now drag this material onto the first layer. Beautiful, isn't it? Now, what you're gonna do is go over here and add a plane. So, this is our basic plane, but make it a little bigger. Okay, this is awesome because it's gonna give an effect like we have a huge space. Okay, this is it. But we can add something more. Go over here and select light. Move the light to the position you want, and I want to be right here. Press animate. You got this. Now you're gonna you're going to ask me. How am I going to add a shadow or something like that? But, I have figured this out too. Go to shadow. Shadow should be shadow map soft. And if you press animate now, you'll see you have an epic 3D text. Also, you got an epic um, um, font. So, it looks awesome. You can rotate this. And now to render this, go over here to render, render settings, and on the save, choose the output path. I'm going to be on my desktop. Okay. Mm, should be named YouTube. YouTube. Okay. Let's save it. Save. Um. 
format should be JPEG like that. Make it high and undick it. Now press render. And it is done. Hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and please subscribe and like my other videos. There are gonna be more tutorials coming soon. Okay, goodbye.